Good morning students. In this class, I'll be doing class 10 Samachir Kalvi syllabus or matriculation syllabus, 6th chapter trigonometry. Exercise 6.1 in second subdivision, second sub. Prove the following identities. Cos theta by 1 plus sin theta is equal to secant theta minus tan theta. So, we'll take LHS here. So, LHS is equal to cos theta by 1 plus sin theta. So, now for the sum, a different way we are going to prove. That is, in the denominator we are having 1 plus sin theta. Here we need to prove the RHS as secant theta minus tan theta. So, we are going to multiply 1 minus sin theta to the numerator and the denominator. So, 1 minus sin theta. So, now the numerator will be cos theta into 1 minus sin theta divided by, here you have 1 plus sin theta into 1 minus sin theta. A plus B into A minus B will be A square minus B square. Okay. So, we have an identity that sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1. So, when we bring this 1 to this side, it will become sin square theta minus 1 is equal to minus cos square theta. That is 1 minus sin square theta is equal to cos square theta. So, here we got 1 minus sin square theta. So, that is equal to cos square theta. So, cos theta into 1 minus sin theta divided by cos square theta. So, here we have cos theta. Here 1 cos theta will get cancelled. So, we will get 1 minus sin theta in divided by cos theta. So, this cos theta is common to both the terms in the numerator. That is 1 minus cos theta. We can split it and write. 1 by cos theta minus sin theta by cos theta. So, 1 minus cos theta is secant theta. Okay. So, 1 minus cos theta is secant theta minus sin theta by cos theta is tan theta. So, this is the thing. We are asked to prove it in the RHS. So, hence we have proved the identity. Hence it is split. Okay. Thank you.